Hello, sir. Hi, I'm George. How are you? I'm very well. Wow. Well, I'm Tony Rance here, uh, Toastmaster at the Complete Angler, and we're going to try and teach you to be a Toastmaster today for a wedding. So, for a real live wedding. Uh, well, a real live wedding. That's what you'll have to do. Yeah. Now, the key points I want you to learn today are one, bringing the into the receiving line. Two, bringing the bride and bridegroom into the room. Three, taking them over and cutting the cake. Four making announcements from the top table, and five, retiring from the room. When we're doing the receiving line, the first thing we've got to do is make sure we've got the line right. Right. Because if you don't have the line right... The order of people. That's correct. Right. Well done. Now, the first person should be the person who's invited them to the wedding. So the, if the in invitation says, Mr and Mrs David Jones, you make sure that Mrs David Jones is the first person who meets them. Ladies and gentlemen, would you please greet the bride and the bridegroom, Mr. and Mrs. David Jones. This may be the first time they've actually been called that. Right. Because up until oh, then... Of course, because they've just literally got married. got married. So you're saying it for the first time. Yeah. So for them, it's really exciting. It's exciting. The room is going to be exciting. Yeah. The way you said it then, just even just that one moment was like really excited. I wanted to start clapping or something. Ladies and gentlemen, we're now going to cut this rather marvellous cake. So we would ask the bride and the bridegroom to join us by the cake. And we would ask you to bring your cameras and make sure you get a nice picture. Right. <clears throat> <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, we are about to invite the bride and groom over to the cake to cut the cake. And we invite you over with your cameras to take some photographs. Ladies and gentlemen, three, two, one. Cut the cake, smile at the camera. Now I've got people around there. What am I asking, going to ask you to do, the first thing you're going to do? I am going to get their attention. I'm going to mean business. Do it. Right, OK. And so I say, ladies, so I say something? All right, I'm going to do it first. OK. Ladies and gentlemen, please be seated. Good. We're getting there. Well done. Ladies and gentlemen, please be standing. It is time for the bride and bridegroom to retire from the room and you will follow. Excellent. Not bad. Excellent. I didn't think that was bad. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to present George to you. George has been trained to be a Toastmaster today, and we want to see what experts think of his efforts and whether we would employ him here at the Complete Angler. OK, George, it's now over to you, and I want you to show the ladies and gentlemen what you can do and what you've learned today. Be kind. Ladies and gentlemen, our bride and bridegroom are now going to retire from the room, so we'd ask you to stand and follow us. Well done. That was okay, wasn't it? It was a bit round the wrong way, but a bit well, round the wrong way. That doesn't matter about that. Doesn't matter. Okay. That was good. So you did very well there. But what do these people think? So, Alison, would you employ me as a Toastmaster? Absolutely. Your voice is crystal clear and you've got a lovely smile. Oh, wow, that's good news. So it started off a bit, a bit bad, but then kind of improved. Your, your memory improved as you went along. Yeah, I think it was everybody just looking at me like this. It was like being on The Apprentice. It was pretty petrifying. But now everybody's smiling, so that couldn't have been that bad. 